Hello, I'm John Walton, and welcome to the Runway Girl Network Pax X Minute in association with Aviation Gate. Underneath the Apex Expo in Singapore's Marina Bay Sands this week was the smaller but no less interesting Aircraft Interiors Expo Asia event. Seatmakers brought their latest wares to show the Asia Pacific market just what's on offer. The biggest news is that in-flight power is coming to low-cost carriers. AirAsia's new seat maker Mirus is working with fellow Brits IFPL and Aussie mates Digicore to put a sleek, smart, high-power USB socket in the armrest of over 300 AirAsia planes. That's great news for passengers in the ASEAN region, but it also raises the bar for LCCs internationally. Southwest? Ryanair? EasyJet? Your move. Runway Girl Network has been tracking the development of the side-slip seat for some time, where the aisle seat slides right over the middle to enable passengers to board and leave the plane more easily, and also makes life a lot easier for passengers with reduced mobility. It's the first time we've seen the seat in the flesh, and I was really impressed by the functionality and comfort, especially since the middle seat is staggered backwards. That moves the shoulders of the middle seat passenger back just a few inches, but you can really feel the difference. A little less innovatively, Italian seat maker Avio Interiors has yet another staggered seating concept on the market, but the interesting thing is that they're not planning to offer this without direct aisle access. Are we seeing the end of the midnight clamber over a slumbering aisle seat passenger from those seats without access to the aisle for every traveller? That's all for this week. Follow us on Twitter at ThatJohn and at RunwayGirl, keep up to the minute with the PaxX hashtag, and join us next time for the Runway Girl Network PaxX Minute.